Dear student, we would like to take you through the sso.map.ac.ug. There are new updates that have come up. When you go to the site, you type sso.map.ac.ug. The mark auth comes up and it says choose an account type. Since you're not a staff, you choose a student account and it has two options, activate my webmail account, change or recover my password. Meaning you can do all these services right here. So I'll choose activate my webmail account and then the first thing that comes up is the important information, the instructions. Number one says accepted registration number formats. That's how they are. And they are without spaces. We encourage you to read from one, two, three, four, five, so that you don't make any mistake. Step one says enter a valid student and registration number combination below to get started. So for this tutorial, we'll use this student details also put the registration number and then it comes up and as you can see it says your account Ezra don't waste you got students on mark.ac.ug is almost ready add an alternative email and password your password should have more than eight characters at least one uppercase one special character and one number and an example is given so these are the details that come up so I'll get an alternative email address that I'll use for this tutorial. Ensure that it's not for your girlfriend or boyfriend or parent. If you don't have one, go to Gmail, Yahoo, Hotmail, or any other external provider and create them. So I'll follow the password rules and put my password. Ah, take sense through. Depending on your network, uh, it will take time or even a short time. So let's wait for it to come up. It's activating. Okay. So to validate the alternative email you provided, we have sent an activation code to it. Enter the code below to complete your webmail activation process. Should you not find the activation code in your inbox, check the spam folder. So I'll just come there and check. As you can see, it has come mark webmail activation code. I'll open it up and copy and paste those details. Then I'll click activate account. As you can see, congratulations, your account has been successfully activated. Note down your webmail address and memorize your password. So this is what you need to note down. And then to get your password, you'll just check and then it will come up and then you can write down your password as well. So you'll use this new webmail account to send and receive emails by logging in at webmail.mark.ac.ug. I'll just try that out, webmail.mark.ac.ug and then I'll come and copy and then I'll put the password and click login. As you can see, I have successfully logged in. Thank you as we continue to build for the future.